Well, here we are back again with another video. First up and foremost, I hope you boys all had a fantastic Christmas. I know I did. I got everything I ever wanted. A Lynx Africa pack. To be honest with you boys, I never saw it coming. It's not like I've had the same bloody Lynx Africa pack for the last 10 Christmases in a row. I might as well be a fortune teller. Because in another 365 days when it's Christmas, I can guarantee you I'm getting another Lynx Africa pack. Now as good as a Lynx Africa pack might be, at the end of Christmas day I always lie in bed. I look at the ceiling. I just think to myself, why have I been given deodorant and fucking body wash the last 10 years in a row? Am I really that bloody smelly? Do I really smell like a prostitute's clam? I like to hope not. Every time I go out in public and someone gives me a funny look, I think to myself, fuck, do I smell like shit? Or do I just look like my nan's foot? But then I think to myself, I can't smell. I've used my Lynx Africa. So then I think it must be because I'm ugly, then I lie in bed even more depressed than I was beforehand. Now after many sleepless nights analyzing the situation, going through every possible scenario in my head, I'm willing to take some responsibility as to why I keep receiving the Africa packs. You know, sometimes when you get a present you don't like and you just act excited because you want to be grateful, and you're like, fuck yeah, this is awesome. This is so cool. And then when the person goes you sort of look at it and you stare at it and you think what in the fuck is this piece of shit I think that's why I keep getting it each year because the person who buys it for me thinks I'm so excited to see it you know my reaction is like I've just been bought a brand new Harley Davidson maybe next Christmas when I get it I might say grab this can of deodorant shove it up your ass and spray it I hate it maybe then I might get something else for Christmas and to top things off we got some socks and some jockeys that's my Christmas in a nutshell who have we got here the big bad Mario look at him go bang two three Four, five, would you look at that? Call me Michael Buble. So it was Christmas day, I was sitting on my bed staring at my Lynx Africa pack. Then I hear a notification on my phone. So I picked up my phone like a fly on shit, I was just like straight to the phone to see what the fuck the notification was. And sure as pig shit, the Nout Boys had posted a brand new Instagram story. It's safe to say I felt like a 10 year old on Christmas. Except in reality, I was a 23 year old on Christmas with a fucking Lynx Africa pack. Nonetheless, we checked the story and it said this. In 2021, we'll be sponsoring a ton of dope people under full send. If you think you can rep the send, email all your social media links too. Then they had an email down below. Then there was another story that said they're looking at sponsoring gamers and streamers under the full send brand. So you best believe I jumped straight on my computer and I sent an email that quick. I was hitting those keys like Stevie Wonder. I've never typed an email so fast in my life. The full send brand want to sponsor vloggers, gamers, streamers. And quite frankly, I am all of the above. If you guys don't already know, yes, I have a vlog channel and I've got over a hundred vlogs on there. We've got drinking challenges, pranks, parties, drifting, racing, you name it, it's on there. On top of that, we stream every single day on twitch.tv slash watch Mario live. We're currently on a 245 day stream streak. And on top of that, we post games videos on this channel here. It's safe to say I'm a man of all trades. Now I'm not one to toot my own horn. If anything, I put myself down before anybody else. But if there's any gamer or streamer that fits the full send brand, I think I'll be up there. The Nout Boys love slamming Coronas, so do I. <laughs> The Nout Boys love slamming White Claws, so do I. The Nout Boys like fucking with people in public, so do I. Yeah, hi, can I just get one um, frozen sour raspberry, please? Oh, yeah. <laughs> And on top of all that, I'm a professional gaming athlete. There's nothing I won't do. You guys give me a challenge. You say, Mario, slam 20 bottles of Corona as fast as you can. I'll do it. You say, Mario, go out tomorrow and get a full sim tattoo. Show us you're keen. I'll do it. You set the challenge, and I'll fucking seal the deal. I'm not here to fuck spiders. I'm 23 years old. I've been doing this as my full-time job for the last seven months. I've got over 800 videos on this channel. Over 100 on the vlog channel. I'm on an over 245-day stream streak on Twitch. I'm willing to put it all on the line for this shit. To be sponsored by Nauk would be like the ejaculation at the end of the porno. It would just be magnificent. Now, the odds of the Nauk boys seeing my email to them is quite frankly slim to none. But they did say to feel free to tag them on Instagram, tag them on Twitter. They said tweet them videos links. So if you boys think that I deserve to be sponsored by Full Send, give me a cheeky little tag in their Instagram post. Tweet them this video. 
Write them a paragraph. Write them a love letter. We need to get their attention, ladies and gentlemen. We're sitting here praying to God, hoping for the best. You know, most gamers sit here and drink G Fuel or energy drinks. I sit here and drink Coronas. I mean, name another gamer that fits the full scene brand as well as I do. I think we'd really go together like Johnny Sins and Riley Reed. So Kyle, Jesse, Steve, if you guys do see this video, as I said, set a challenge. Say, mate, you think you're keen? You think you got what it takes? Go and do this. Go and milk a cow in the middle of the fucking Saharas and deliver us the glass. Consider it done. Now, on top of all that, ladies and gentlemen, this is my last video of the year 2020. And thank fuck for that. What a shit year 2020's been. I mean, look at that. I just killed myself of my own care package. 2020 has to have been one of the worst years of not just my life, but everybody's life. You know, we went from living life as normal to not being able to go to the bloody pub for a beer. 2020 really took a turn for the worst. Now, I know we say this bullshit every year. This year's the year. This year's the year. I truly do believe 2021 is the year to fuck up the game. We're going to be pumping out the vlogs on the vlog channel. Go and subscribe. We're going to be pumping out the videos on this channel. We are getting another 100k plaque on that wall. It will happen this year. We will be getting partnered on Twitch. Team 7 will be blowing up. And we will be continuing doing this as a full-time job for as long as it takes to make it happen. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you so much for all the support through the year 2020. It truly does mean the world to me. Thank you guys for watching. If you did somewhat enjoy it, slap the like button, drop a sub, and tweet at the now, boys. Let's make it happen. See you all next year. Das Vedanya.